And now weather with Melissa Hackney on KPBI News 6, your news source for East Idaho. Here's a live look at I-15 and the Portneuf Valley, courtesy of our Portneuf Medical Center webcam. So the sun is starting to come up right now, and it's going to be a beautiful first day of school for many students. 69 is what we have right now in Pocatello, 56 in Idaho Falls. So you could probably leave that light jacket at home as we are having a warm start to the day. Five mile per hour winds in both Pocatello and in Idaho Falls. Taking a look at our satellite and radar map of the region, you can see we do have a little bit of cloud coverage and some scattered showers to the west of us that could be heading our way as we do have showers and thunderstorms possible. 87 for the high in both Pocatello and in Idaho Falls. And so taking a look at our record temperatures, this is from one year ago today. 94 degrees, 97 in Pocatello. So we're not going to be near those record breaking temperatures, more around the average temperatures, but even about four degrees above. Overnight lows, though, are going to be above average. 64 in Pocatello, 54 in Idaho Falls. Since midnight, both areas have been dry. Sunset or sunrise is happening right now. Sunset is going to be at around 8 10 tonight. So today in the lower plain, there is going to be a chance of showers and thunderstorms, about a 50% chance, partly sunny skies. We're all going to have winds between 10 to 15 miles per hour with gusts even higher than that. So it definitely could be a breezy day. Temperatures are going to be around 87 in both Pocatello and in American Falls. Then in the upper plain, showers and thunderstorms possible, 87 in Idaho Falls. And in the mountains and highlands today, they're going to have partly sunny skies, 77 in Island Park, 86 in Milad City. 85 in Arco, also with a chance of showers and thunderstorms. Tonight in the mountains and highlands, still a slight chance of showers and thunderstorms overnight. 54 in Soda Springs, 50 in Arco and Salmon, 56 in Chalice. Then in the lower plain, partly cloudy skies, a warm overnight low of 64 in Pocatello, 60 in American Falls. And in the upper plain, also partly cloudy skies, 52 in Rexburg and in St. Anthony. So tomorrow in the upper plain, partly sunny skies. We are going to start to dry up tomorrow. No chance of showers and thunderstorms. 89 in Idaho Falls, 86 in Rexburg. So we're going to be slightly warmer than today. And our winds are also going to start to die down as we'll have wind speeds between about 5 to 7 miles per hour. In the lower plain, also partly sunny skies, 87 in both Pocatello and Blackfoot. And in the mountains and highlands, they're going to have a slight chance of showers tomorrow, partly sunny skies, 84 in Soda Springs, 86 in Malad City, 81 up in Island Park. Then for our Pocatello six-day forecast, we are going to start to clear up tomorrow, and then on Friday, mostly sunny skies, 88 for the high, 87 on Saturday, cooling down to about 79 on Monday with the chance of precipitation. Then for Idaho Falls, six-day forecast, sunshine on Saturday with a high of 87 and, oh, we're still in Pocatello. Let's now move to Idaho Falls. Sunny skies on Saturday with a high of 89, and they're going to be cooling down to 82 on Monday, also with the chance of precipitation.